Okay, so from time to time people ask me how to embed a YouTube video on a Dreamweaver page. What I have, I have a very simple page I've laid out for a, a website I do called Skyland Picks. I'm not going to belabor the point what we, how we do, what I'm doing. It's going to show you how you do it. Uh, you want, first of all, what you want to do is whatever page you're on, let's say I want to put the video maybe here before this paragraph. I'm going to go ahead and put a return in so that I've got a place for that video to be. And wherever your cursor is, is where this embedded video is going to go. Now, if I wanted to put a link to a video here, I could just say link to Tony's video. Tony's video. So once again, I'm Dreamweaver CC, and this is uh, August uh, 12th of 2013. Okay, so I'm going to go to YouTube right quick and tap, tap over to that. And here's a guitar instrumental thing that I've done. I'm going to embed it on that page. You can go there and watch it if you want to hear some kind of jazzy, cool little uh, YouTube uh, guitar video I've done. But what you do, and once again, this is August of 2013, you're going to go down here to Share. See where your Share button is on YouTube underneath it, uh, beside About. Now, you, if you wanted to create a link to the video, you know, you, all you have to do is copy this piece of text right here, or this link, Control C, or you copy, edit, copy, whatever. I'm going to tab back over, and if I wanted to do that, I would highlight this in Dreamweaver. Then I'll get down here to the bottom where the link hole is. I'm going to do Control V to paste that into link. And so what I've got then is I've got a link to the video. And if I want that link, I'm going to highlight it again. If I want that link to open up a new page, I'll go here where Target is, and I'll put blank. And then that video will not, show, will not take the place of this page. It'll actually, when you click on it, it will go and bring up a YouTube uh, page, the other YouTube page we're just looking at. That's not what people tend to want to do anymore. They want to actually embed the video if there's a player on this page. So I'm going to undo this for a second. The cursor is still right there. See, and I can put the cursor wherever I want to. If I put the cursor down here, the video will show up here. I'm going to put the cursor right back there, and I'm going to go to the code view. And right here, you don't have to worry about code. You don't have to be able to do anything with code. It puts the cursor where it has to be to embed this video. Now I'm going to go back real briefly. I'm going back over here and I'm getting this video. This time, instead of doing share this video, I'm going to click on embed. See that right there? And it's going to give me the, uh, the code for embedding that video. And right here it is. And it gives you various sizes, whatever you want. Right now it's set up to do 560 pixels by 315. Let's say I don't want that to be that big. I can click on custom size. I can give it, a, it gives you some standard sizes here. There's 640 by 360. Here's 853 by 480. And these are all sizes that are used by, you know, many web browsers. So you can stick with one of these if you want to. I am going to go ahead and give it a custom size. I'm going to tell it to be 480 pixels wide. Uh-oh. Custom size. I'm going to say 480 tab. And it automatically gives me the right pixel aspect. YouTube knows to do this. 270 is what that needs to be. Now I can have it, there are options you have here. I can click on show suggested videos when the video finishes. So in other words, when the video gets finished playing, it would pop up more of my guitar videos. Uh, but I'm not going to have that. Usually people don't want to do that. Enable privacy enhanced mode. There's various different things you can do here. But uh, I'm just going to do the standard iframe is what it is. I'm going I'm to copy this right here. I want a 480 pixel by 270. I can do a custom size. I'm going to do control C. Or it would be option, or option, but Command C on your Mac. Now I'm going to go back to Dreamweaver, and that there sits my cursor still where we left it a while ago. I'm going to do Control V to paste, or Command V, I guess, or just paste it from the Mac. And there you go. Now I've got that in there. We can go back to Design View and look, and there is the video. If I click on Live, it may or may not show. I may have to update my flash. So uh, I, I'm not going to see it here just in the Live View this time. I'm going to I'm going to close this for a second. I'm going to do a control save, control S to save. All right. So uh, the index is the page that I've modified on this crazy little half done website. And I'm going to click on that and I'm going to upload it. To upload it, I click the uh, arrow that points up. So I'm in local view. Right now, that's where I've edited my page. And I've got the file selected. I'm going to click the up and it's going to go up there. Now I should be able to go back to this website, Skyland Picks here. And refresh this. I'm going to do Control F5 to refresh, and there should be my video. And there it is. Very cool. I can hit play, and it should start playing. And like I said before, if we want to see, well, well does it play anything at the end here when it gets to the end? Let's just let it finish up. 
I'll turn the sound off. Here's the end of the video. Me stretching my neck. And it ends. Now I do have uh, ads set up on this particular video, but there you go. That's how you embed a video into a Dreamweaver page. It also works for Vimeo. You can go to Vimeo. You can do the same sort of thing. Go to, the, go to where you share the code and you get your embed code. And you just go back to Dreamweaver. You go into, again, the code view and you put it uh, wherever your cursor is. You, you choose your cursor location. If I want to put the same video in right here, I can do this again. My cursor is right here. Let's say I want that same video or a different video. Let's go get a different video. Just one more time, we'll go through it. We're gonna go back to YouTube. Let's find another of my crazy videos. I'll do a little quick search here. Here is a uh, review of GoPro Hero 3 uh, that we might want to include. Let's just do this one. An ad will play here. Probably a third again bigger. So I'm going to close this. Here is where I've had this video. I'm going to do share. I'm going to do embed. Uh, this time I'm going to let it do its regular size of 560 by 315. And this time I will let it show suggested video at the end. I'm going to go ahead and get this. Control C. Let's go back to our Dreamweaver page. I've got the uh, the link right there. I'm not in live view, I'm in just design. If you're in live, it won't let you paste it in. But I'm gonna go to code, and the cursor's in the right place. I'll do a control V or paste. Then we'll go back to design. And there's the other video at the larger size. See, I'm gonna say file save. Okay, I'm gonna click on that index again. I'm gonna upload it. Now we'll go back again. I'm gonna do an alt tab to get back over here. I'm gonna go to Skyland Peaks homepage again. Control F5 to refresh. There we go. And now you see there are two videos. If I click on this one. It's probably a third again bigger than, than your other video you're shooting. Your now here is, my, here is my video review that. And if I come to the end here of this one, it should show the suggested video, video at the end. Thing. You got, I think you guessable this little camera is. And you'll see here it puts up stuff. And it looks like it shows boobs and stuff. <laughs> Sorry about that. That is the, uh, so these are not my videos, <laughs> but naturally those are people trying to get lots of views. So but that's how it works, folks. Uh, it looks like I need to go ahead and get my thing here floated so it'll stay at the top. This is kind of odd, but there you go. Uh, forgive my bad, my poor design here uh, on this website, that, which I never went to finish, but uh, that's how you embed videos into a Dreamweaver CC document uh, from uh, YouTube. Hope this helps. Bye-bye.